Welcome to quantitative reasoning solution section and uh, we're going to be considering this exercise. Uh, this is for book 4 of Lantern Quantitative Reasoning uh, page 47 exercise 16e. Right. So we have uh, this example. So the examples will serve as a guide for you to walk through the other um, questions okay so we have six two three nine and the second example we have 15 5 3 and 18 so uh, let's try and uh, go through them we have six plus three nine 15 plus three 18 right so 18 minus 15 is three the same way 9 minus 6 is 3. 5 times 3 is 15. 2 times 3 is 6. So this would work. So we can solve. Right? So to, to find 9, we have uh, 6 plus 3 is 9. To find... 6, you just do direct opposite. We have 9 minus 3 is 6. And to find 3, you have 9 minus 6 is 3. Okay, so to get to find 2, we have 6 divided by 3 is two right so uh let's adopt the same method for this to find 18 you have 15 plus 3 18 to find 15 to find 15 you have 18 minus 3 is 15. Remember, uh, addition is the direct opposite of subtraction. To find 3, you have 18 minus 15 is 3. And to find 5, we have 15 divided by 3 is 5. So as you can see, uh, both the method worked for both examples, right? So, uh, that's the end of this. Do well to use this method or guide to solve the rest of your questions. And remember to subscribe to this channel for more quantitative solution. Thank you. Bye.